दिस वीडियो इज मेड पॉसिबल बाय एनवाटो एलिमेंट्स I am using After Effects. If you have not installed After Effects yet, you can download it from the link in the description. Open After Effects and create a new composition. I am calling it Halloween Text Animation. As always, I am using the 1920 by 1080 resolution and a frame rate of 30. Let's keep the duration around 10 second. Now create a new solid layer and call it the background. Use any color you want. I'm keeping this dark red color and hit OK. Then unselect your text layer. Go to the tools and select the text tool. Click anywhere on the screen and start typing your text. Of course, you are free to use any text you want. Now eject from the typing box and align your text into the center. Please note, I'm using this latent font. You can download it from the link in the description. Now select the move tool and make sure you are at the first frame. Then go to the effects and the presets and search for the decrease tracking. Double click on it to apply it onto the text layer and this is how it looks now. Now select the text layer and press U to reveal all keyframes. Let's grab this end keyframe and place it onto the 2 second position. This way we can make the animation speed slow. Now press S to open scale and add a keyframe on it. Then go to the five second position and change the scale value to around seventy percent. Now, if you can see, the anchor point of the text layer is placed at the bottom of the text, but we need to place it right into the center. You can do it very easily. Just press Y, then press and hold the Control or Command key on your keyboard and drag this anchor point right into the center. This is looking much better. Let's grab the Move tool and press U to reveal all keyframes. Select these bottom keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. If you check the animation, this is how it looks now. Looking much better. You can always adjust the keyframe duration according to your requirement. If you want to make it slow, just keep the keyframe apart from each other. If you want to increase the speed, you can bring them closer. Now right click on your text layer and choose pre compose I am calling it halloween text animation Now go to the effects and the presets and search for the cc smear Place it onto the layer and it will add this kind of look so let's place it right at this position and first I am going to change the radius value to 0 so that we can focus on the position instead of the look Now grab this center point and place it right at this position now this bottom anchor point will be away from the text so that we can have the dripping effect i am placing it something like here not bad let's zoom in and let's place it right at the bottom of the text now you can increase the radius according to your requirement let me use the value of 30 and the reach value will be 0 then go to the first frame position or anywhere you want to add the animation let's go to around 4 uh, and a half second position and add keyframe on the reach then go to around 6 second position and this time increase the reach value to a higher number so that the dripping effect move away from the screen again press u to reveal all keyframes then select both keyframes and press f9 to easy ease them check the animation and this is how it looks now not bad let me adjust some keyframes i'm making it slow and placing it right at the 6 second position so this is how it looks not bad now if we can see the radius of the drip is bit high so i'm going to change the radius value to 20 and it will look much better perfect Let's add this dripping effect at the beginning. I am going to select all keyframes and placing it at the beginning. And we need to adjust some settings. Let me adjust this center point into the letter L. 
let's go to the five second position select this effect and press ctrl or command plus d to make duplicate of it again press u to reveal all keyframes grab the second keyframes and place them right here let's select the keyframes once again and place them after four second now we just need to place the center point of the effect and it will create some nice looking dripping effect let's see not bad now i don't want this drip to completely move away from the frame so i'm going to grab this center point and placing it right here this way it will have this kind of look you can always make the animation slower by increasing the distance between both keyframes now make one more duplicate and i'm quickly making more of the dripping effect of course you can make it according to a requirement i'm just showing you the way the destiny is yours now let's check the animation and this is looking much better you can play with the keyframes placement to make the dripping effect more dynamic now in this case the dripping effect is looking dynamic but the starting point is same so we can fix it let's place these keyframes one by one and place them at some dynamic position something like this and now we are done Thank you for watching this tutorial. I will see you in the next one. Till then, good luck and peace. Design better project faster with Envato Elements. Unlimited download After Effects templates, logo intro music, background music, sound effects and more. Visit the first link in the description and start downloading today. Deliver better video faster with Envato Elements.